Hey guys, Hayden from Engineering Adventures and welcome to another awesome episode. On this episode, we're gonna be having a look at the beautiful Dual Cab Ranger. Now, we thought we'd give you guys a bit of a rundown on this Ranger as it's appeared in a couple of videos and it appears on our website, but we haven't really done anything about this one in the past. So this beautiful Dual Cab Ranger is actually my personal vehicle and pretty much the vehicle that started Engineering Adventures. So I picked this vehicle up back in 2019 and have since been modifying it to be a beautiful long range tourer. As you can see, it's got all the mods, it's got all the kit and it's pretty much ready to go. Now part of what we do with this one as well is we actually kind of do a bit of research and development as well. So some of the products that we recommend to customers have either been on this vehicle, we've had or we've broken. So it's all part and parcel of what we do at Engineering Adventures to make sure that you guys are getting the best quality products for your setups as well. Now, unfortunately, on our Fraser and Morton trip, we had a bit of a failure in our draw system. So the draw runners themselves failed, got locked out, and we had some issues with the whole system throughout the trip. So we've come back, we've ripped it out, and we've decided to put in a new system. Now, off-road systems have been one of our suppliers for customers for a couple of years now. So we finally decided to bite the bullet and put one of their systems into the back of the big white Ranger. So off-road systems down in Smeaton Grange do pretty much any, any form of custom draw systems, whether it be a tub system for a dual cab, a wagon such as a 200 or 300 series Land Cruiser all the way through a train canopy setups that you might get on the back of a 79 series. Anything you want, they can make it happen. So we've come down, we've pretty much put together, I reckon, one of the best draw system designs that we can get with a little surprise as well. And I'm keen to show you guys that at the end as that's going to be absolutely awesome. So one of the biggest things that we've been trying to look at when it comes to draw systems is weight. So one of the issues we had with the draw system in the back of the big rig was the fact that the original one was timber as well. So part of what we're trying to do is we're trying to also reduce the weight as a tourer and make sure it's able to do those long trips on good fuel economy as well as staying legal with the GVM. So RS systems are a complete aluminium fabrication around the majority of the body. So that means that we're gonna be able to reduce the weight significantly when it comes to the rest of the setup. The team from ORS have been absolutely awesome and are gonna let us behind the scenes showing us the full manufacturing process that they use putting a draw system into the back of a ute. So, stay tuned, let's have a look at how they do it and let's see what we can do for the back of the big white Ranger. Let's go.
So we're down here for the weekend with the RS team and we thought it was the perfect opportunity to show you guys through the brand new drawer system that we've got in the back of the Ranger. So let's take a look. I tell you what guys, I am absolutely stoked with how this has turned out. It has been better than expected and met every criteria that I needed for the new draw system. So the team at ORS have outdone themselves and I am super happy with the final project. So I'll run you through over the, across the back here and then we'll open it up and show you guys exactly what we've done. And we'll show you finally the little surprise that we've got in store. So on the right hand side here, we have tucked in behind a Dun & Watson 48 litre wheel large water tank paired with a Victron battery monitor for the monitoring our 12 volt a water pump and our inverter there as well our fridge slide with a traveler table up top there as well and the kick-ass oven up top we then have a custom made drawer that sits 350 high and goes pretty much the length of the car there as well and in on the left is our 12 volt system with all of our outlets and then in behind is everything we need, DC DC charger, MPPT, and our battery from Custom Lithium in behind there as well. So let's open it up and show you guys it fully extended, set up, ready to go as we would at camp. So this was the big secret. It was a beautiful kitchen that ourselves and ORS have done up and it looks absolutely fantastic. So we've got the fridge slide for the 75 litre Waco. A beautiful 2000 watt induction cooker that is countersunk, awesome stainless steel table, and a nice little pull out drawer for the sink. And we're going to put a bit of a chopping board on that as well. On the left, we've got our awesome custom sized drawer. So this is 350 deep by 1200 long, and it is absolutely awesome the amount of stuff that we can now fit in here and easily access. So we've got some of the crash pods in here already, which are absolutely fantastic. And then on top, we've got the awesome stainless steel table on top. You can never have enough table space. It's the one thing I stress with all our builds, you can never have enough table space. So we've maximized as much as we could, and I'll tell you what, we are super stoked with how it has turned out. Then to finish up, we have an awesome custom built traveler table, which tucks in there up the top nicely, nice and snug, but can come out, be pulled off to the side and set up anywhere in camp for any kind of purpose, whether it be a barbecue, little snack table, dinner table, or anything else in between. Super happy with the build. We have maximized every little bit of space in the back of this dual cab tub. And I'll tell you what, I'm super stoked with how this has turned out. So there we have it guys that is our brand new drawer system in the back of the ranger and i'm super stoked with how it has turned out if you guys are looking for any kind of custom work whether it be drawer systems 12 volt come have a chat to the team at engineering adventures and we will make it happen for you big shout out to the team at off-road systems for this one who have done an absolutely fantastic job with the back of this ranger cannot speak highly enough of them especially being australian made in-house products we love that and that is the biggest thing we're trying to push for with engineering adventures in the meantime, check out the rest of the YouTube videos online. Keep an eye out for both the Work Ranger and the Big Rig out and about on the roads and the tracks. And we'll see you guys out there four-wheel driving. But in the meantime, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy. <laughs>